up riders happy 4th of July and as a tradition of mine uh, I like to go see a movie in the afternoon on 4th of July not only that but I like to go see a movie once a week usually on a Tuesday so let's get right at it uh, I apologize if the audio is a little bit off I got a new phone I didn't have the right adapter for my regular microphone so I'm gonna try to lean in a little bit so that you can hear what I'm saying this week I watched Baby Driver, uh, a film uh, directed by Edward uh, um, Edgar Wright, uh, starring Kevin Spacey, uh, John Hamm, Elsa Gonzalez, Jamie Foxx, and of course, I'm losing the name of the the actress and actor who are the leads. Unfortunately, I, I apologize for that. They're newcomers, and they were phenomenal. So the story is about. A uh, kid named Baby, who is a getaway driver for criminals, but he's trying to pay off a debt to the lead criminal. However, that's not always how the story goes once you pay off your debt. So I'm not going to go into any more about the plot outlines um, after that little summary. Positives? Well, I did a recap of of the movies uh, from the first part of the summer and this was a great start to the second part of the summer um, just an excellent excellent film uh, I, what I really liked about it was the fact that we had two two leads who are newcomers who were fairly good really good in their roles against some of these outstanding this outstanding cast that they had so they really held their own um, the editing uh, and the car chases, absolutely fabulous. You will not be disappointed with any of that. The editing especially, I mean, Edgar Wright's really known for his comedy pieces, but his comedies uh, have typically had action uh, action parts to it. I mean, he was uh, actually the first director for Ant-Man. So, uh, so this was, uh, this was fabulous. I mean, he has, uh, you know, him and Guy Ritchie are fairly similar in their styles, uh, but there's actually um, quite a distinction. Um, I really enjoyed uh, what what Edgar Wright with what Edgar Wright did with the film, and and so the editing was just absolutely spectacular. And of course, the cast you can't you can't fault the cast on this at all. So. Um, so there, there's that, and uh, the negatives, really, I, I don't know, I really enjoyed this movie. I thought it was spectacular from beginning to end. I mean, it, it's arguably the best movie so far of the summer. I mean, I know there's Guardians of the Galaxy and there's Wonder Woman, but this was a really, really well done film. And, uh, I mean, I like the story. I didn't feel like there was lulls. Uh, the pacing was excellent so I mean the only negative I would say is John Bernthal wasn't in it enough I'm a big John Bernthal fan so I didn't really feel like he was in it uh, enough um, he was there in the first act for a little bit first scene the first scene is great and one of the things to look for in this movie is how they use the sound I mean sound is a huge theme throughout the movie but especially in the first couple scenes how they how they're really using sound for a really cool effect and the soundtrack absolutely fabulous so listen to how the audio shakes out throughout the movie how it's used how the sound designer really really worked with with this and and did a fabulous job so I highly recommend seeing this movie it's a great um, um, it's a great great film to see it's worth the penny. It's worth going to see it in the theater. So there you have it. Go see Baby Driver. So please like us on Facebook. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Um, and find us on Anchor and, and listen to our podcast if you'd like to listen to the Ride Home Reviews on the go. So go see Baby Driver, and I'll see you again next week. Take care. Bye.